It's important to know how to shoot in the wind because it's the biggest factor of weather in archery. Wind can carry your arrows a lot and it can affect how your sight is moving on the target. So I think knowing how to shoot in the wind is really, really important, especially for World Cups. So before I start the shot, I assess the wind just to see how fast it's going and what direction it's going in. If it's gusty, I'll try and shoot when it's not blowing super hard. And if it's a constant wind, then I'm usually a little more confident in the spot I pick to aim. Um, yeah, I just pick that spot before I go, and then once I draw up, that sight sits wherever I want it to. Aiming on is when you aim in the center, and usually when there's no wind or very little wind to where it wouldn't really affect it. Aiming off is aiming off center so that wind carries your arrows back to the middle. If the wind is constant, I'll uh, move my sight because it doesn't really change between arrow to arrow. If it's changing a lot and if it's gusty, I'll aim off. That way I get a more accurate spot each time the wind changes. The best way to practice shooting in the wind is shooting in the wind. But if that is not possible, then I recommend the water bottle drill. And the water bottle drill is taking a half full water bottle, tying a string to the cap, and tying that other end of the string to the base of your stabilizers. And that way when you draw up, the water bottle will swing back and forth and mimic the movement of wind on your sight and you can learn how to steady it down. I do this drill when I know I'll be um, competing somewhere where it's windy. Like for example, Arizona was um, a week and a half ago and it was very windy. So before that tournament, I practiced the water bottle drill. And um, if, I, if I'm not sure like what tournaments are next, I'll just do it because I think it's a good routine drill to practice. If somebody doesn't necessarily have an outdoor range to practice at and doesn't get that wind practice often, they can use this drill indoors and that way it's similar to practicing outdoors. It gives you the benefit of confidence in knowing that you can have a steady shot in the wind and also knowing that like it's an extra thing that you're prepared on that somebody else might not have trained as. I really encourage you to give this drill a try. It's a great way to practice in the wind even when there's no wind and it'll make you better and more prepared for competitions.